Hello everyone and welcome back to the walkthrough. We're going from level 7 to level 8, which is right at the top of the tower there. The realm of the heavens. Oh, it's so dark and spooky, which means the camera's gonna suck for this screen, but that doesn't matter because it's just the map screen. And we start off, as I said, with the realm of the heavens, and whoa! Would you look at this? We're in Sky World now. There is the land down below. It's kind of spooky. Now being this high up in the sky, but I suppose we are up in the heavens. But it couldn't possibly be heaven. I mean, just look at all this danger. Holy poopers. I mean, come on now. You're going into the hole. And you're going to go off that hole. Yeah. Awesome. And wait, there's stuff over there? Hmm. Maybe I can open that up later? I don't know. Oh, I see a portal to the dark world, or I should say a possibility to go to the dark world. You... you stop being a coward and die like a man. Yeah! Come on. Come on. You... Maybe I should be going to... Oh, no, you don't. Maybe I should go into square formation. I'm not so sure. Ugh. You stop being a freaking coward. You... Oh, shoot. Now you're hitting me from the side. Dang it. Wait, there's a heart over here. I could use that. Yeah, I'm happy. And... Okay, now I should be able to safely... Well, I, should, I shouldn't say safely. I should be able to easily hit you now. Because you aren't going to be uh, protected by your little cronies. You swing there, and I'll swing up here. And I see you're a lot more durable than the other ones. Can I just, like, knock you into the hole? Because that would be a lot nicer. Oh, I can't knock you in the hole. Dang it. That's too bad. Well, you're dead anyway. Ooh, force jam! And a lot of force gems here. And I think what I'm supposed to do is go into those little portals down there. Not sure, but let's just see. Into the dark world we go. And there's some spooky statues greeting us when we came down here. I don't know why, but there's a switch. Oh, there's some... Uh-oh, what have I done? I think I, I think I just unleashed some guards upon the world. Why are there only guards, like, um, like, I mean, I didn't see any guards in the dark world down there when I went down there, so what the poop was that? Are they like, can I go down this portal, like, for the heck of it? Oh, I guess this is where the guards reside? Uh, I guess those portals don't take you to the same dark world or something, I don't know, or maybe I didn't notice the, uh, well, no, wait, they are different, because these were, uh, these are switches on the other one. Or I should say whatever those light bulbs you want to call them. They seem like some sort of glowy crystal balls and they're, I don't know, they're weird. Oh wait, this that, that wasn't even the right portal. So I guess this spot right over here where it's glowing, I noticed that earlier. Yeah, I noticed things. Oh no! Now these guys are here. Uh, oh, poopers. Uh, I guess what I'm supposed to do is get a moon pearl and then go back over there to face those guys in the dark world. I'm not sure. Let's well, just... Uh oh Shadow Link. How's it going? Ugh! Ah! What the heck? Where'd those arrows come from? Well, you're dead. Okay, where do these portals take me? I do not know. Probably in the Dark World. Oh, there's some switches. Um... And this is probably the wrong one. Uh... Oh, that made those weird flying things come up again. I... I'm pretty sure you need arrows to kill them. I could be wrong, though. Well, there's that portal. What does this one take me to? One of these has to have a moon pearl somewhere, but they all look pretty much the same, except for a few differences. Oh, shoot! I just seen those switches after I uh, uh, ran myself right into the portal there. Uh, it was just past this portal, right over here. And I'm just gonna do one of these dealios. Wah! All poopers. Gone. There, there we go. Oh, no! I have triggered a great epic battle! And, oh no, don't, don't, don't land on him. Oh, you got some arrow guys here. I'm gonna take you guys off first because of your long distance problems. And, well, you don't have the long distance problem I do, so... I guess that was a bad choice of words on my part. There we go. And I'm gonna kill you if I can, or at least push you towards the side. You guys are annoying. You leave me alone or, I, or I'll just kill you. You know what? Yeah. Right off the cloud you go. It's a wonder how we can stand on clouds anyway. I mean, if you think about it, clouds are made out of evaporated water, basically. So, you know, water isn't the most solid of surfaces to stand on, let alone airborne water. 
And I got a moon pearl! Okay, what's down this last one over here? We're about to find out. Probably just another bonus area. Uh, the, that one that I took towards the right was probably the only right one, so to speak. Oh! I guess it was worth it, because there was a heart container. Awesome! So, let's take a look around back where that portal was, and see what's up at the Dark World. So, I could just throw this right... Oops, I thought I could throw it over here. I guess Link can't throw uh, those pearls very well. Or, I should say... Uh, uh, I, I don't know, I can't think of the name right now, dang it. Ah, uh, whatever. Oh, Moon Pearl, that's it. Yeah, I, I was thinking of the right name. Uh, okay, so these are the guys that were in the Dark World that, were, that I could see. Oh, Feather, well that makes a lot of sense. Now I can cross that gap in that middle room. So I'll just zoop right out of here like that. And now I can jump like the wind across the cloud tops like so. Whee! Alright, now what's over here? A bunch of places... Oh no! Beamos! Why, God, why? Please don't hurt me. Oh, oh, no. Okay. Uh, I just noticed their eyes lo looming at me, and they're very frightening. And am I almost done with the stage or something? Because, oh my god. Because I've already got 1,800 Force Gems, and that's that's nearly the amount that I need. I guess these guys aren't, aren't that bad if you, if you keep doing the Jump Slash thing. So, yeah, that, they are actually... If you have the Rock's Feather, they aren't bad at all. But otherwise, you're going to have a lot of trouble. Force Gem Power-Up! Well, Sword Power-Up. And let's collect the rest of the Force Gems as long as we're here, you know. We might as well make sure that we always have 2,000 to be ready for that portal. And what does this sign say? Strong winds! Oh, poopers! Uh, I see... A lock block over there, and I would like to see what's uh oh down here first. And I know how to defeat you. I just need to color coordinate this battle pose. You oh ah bad sword. You did not swing quick enough. Ah missed. Ah, purple. Oh no. let me let me grab. Or I should not grab. Let me kill. Ooh. That was a nice prize, I have to say. I bet you with all the Force Gems that I'm getting for this level, there is going to be a bunch of Force Fairies waiting for me at the end there. And the wind is pushing me like this, but that's not really much of a problem. Evidently, I can just turn off the wind by pressing that switch for some reason, so that's not really much of a problem at all, now is it? Yeah, it's pretty easy to control on the wind. I'm just kind of like exaggerating things, but hey, when don't I exaggerate things? Um, I guess that's the way that I can go back, uh, if I have to, and that's why there's switches, I mean, there's a switch there. Um, uh, what am I supposed to do here? This is probably just like another double switch portal. Oh, it's a hammer. What would I need with a hammer? I do not know. But I'm sure I'll need it for something, since it was given to me. Ugh, wait, wait, why didn't I hit the switch? Oh, poopers! Ah! Oh, poop! Hold to the right peak again. See, it's not that hard to control, I just kind of, like, let go of the right direction, and, like, messed it all up, and that was kind of poopy, and I'm just going to hit the switch just to keep the wind going, I mean, the wind stop. Now, what am I supposed to do with the hammer? Can I just, like, bang this? Nah, I didn't think so. Oh, 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 I see what you want me to do. Force them there, and... Oh, green... Wait, let me go back over here and see if there's anything to uncover. Like, if I slam the ground here... Will there be anything? No, I didn't see anything. So let's go back to uh, the Chomper's room over here and uh, do a shockwave. Is there... Oh my god, there's a lot of stuff here. Including hidden enemies. Well, that guy was really hyper. Holy poop! up this block over here and continue on our great adventure through the heavens that for some reason we can stand on. There's even things built on top of them for some reason. I don't know how that works and I needed my feather back though. Well, I bet you I could get through this without it. Maybe. I hope. It's gonna be like, oh yeah, okay. 
If I need the feather, I can always go back. Because obviously I'll, you know, I'll have to. Oh my god! Oh, don't do that! Wait, what am I supposed to? Can I like shockwave? Mm, I can shockwave, but that won't do anything. Uh, I'll have to kill you with the hammer then. Or just knock you off, that works. You too! You too! I said you too! Ah! You're not supposed to knock me off, I'm the one that's supposed to knock you off. And there we go. So, let's keep all these links grouped together. That's actually doing that automatically, I might add. It's just keeping them really tight and hooked together. Like a pack of wolves, and uh, you are going down, and literally you're going down, and there we go. And I'm surprised I just didn't need my rock's feather for that. Wait, 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 what is this? Can I only, like, cross this when I have the right color formation or something? That would make a lot of sense. Just for the heck of it. That's what I thought, okay. So let's, let's color coordinate this. Wait for the green. Okay. Woo! Yeah, the green has to be at the top, and all the other ones will, will be in order. I've seen that pattern right away, because I'm used to this vertical formation coloring. So that's why I recognized it right away. I bet you killing you will open the door. Yep. Well, not the door, those drills. Okay, this is switched there. Um, I'm probably going to need links all over the place here. So let's just take one at a time here, like that. And I would like... Oh, no! Don't fall off! Uh, okay, I want to gotta wait for a green one, I guess. Eventually. And it'll come over here. There we go. Switch here. Boots. Woo! And call them over, the, over there. What am I going to use the Pegasus boots? I don't know. Something tells me I'm going to be upgrading them. I guess I'll be seeing, like, probably here I'll have to use them. Yeah! Woo! That was good timing, I have to say. I didn't think I would get it on, on my first shot. Okay, I bet you these move this platform depending on which button you press on which side. Kind of like a D-pad. Yep, just as I thought. Uh, this should be pretty easy then, because I can control this platform whenever I want want it to move, so button go! Yeah, this is really easy, I have to say. Yeah, I noticed this up here. This looked like a good place to hide stuff, so I'm just going to grab that thing right there. Uh-oh, let me, there we go. I would like to pass through here if you don't mind. Thank you. Platform is slightly off screen, but wait, how do I stop those fire spewers from spewing their fire? There's gotta be a switch somewhere around here. Oh, oh, I see it. Let me press this, and will this work? Um, it did. Oh, there's bombs now. Oh, all the um, fire stopped. All of them, even the ones that were um, just spewing at timed intervals. Okay, so I'm gonna leave the Pegasus boots, but oh, I need them for these Dodongos. You eat bomb, please. There we go. You guys are like the easiest boss ever if you know what to do. Just gotta wait for your mouths to open, and I get. Wait, why did you stop there? That was kind of weird. I'm gonna just leave the rest of the links behind and just kind of like yeah. What? And, and they take such a long time to shoot fire. You know that that they're just so vulnerable for such a long time. Come on, shoot fire. Don't stop unless you're going to shoot fire. There you go. That's probably going to blow you up. And I got a force them for that. Wait, wait, wait. I want to... Oh, poopers. I was a little too late there. I really shouldn't have tried to drop a bomb there when he was spewing fire or before he was going to spew fire, but... Oh, well. That's okay. I have, I have plenty of hearts. Bunch of treasure chests here. Oh, my God! Level 2 bombs. I guess I'm supposed to use them to kill this critter. This guy is going to obliterate us with its flames of death. Unless, you know, we kill it like a normal Dodongo. That would also work quite well, I'm betting. I mean, it, he looks like pretty much a normal Dodongo. Yeah, he's a normal Dodongo, just as I thought. So I only need one link for this. Come on, you spew your fire, ginormous blue critter. I, why is, are the normal Dodongos yellow while the big ones are blue? While in other Dodongos, other Dodongos in games, they're green. It's just a mystery. I have no idea, but I am aghast and appalled at this. It is just co constantly confusing. 
And I have 4,557 Force Gems. Holy cow. And I'm, am I at the end? Yeah, I am. Wow. Wow, wow. That was awfully fast. <laughs> well, thanks for watching this part, and I'll see you guys in the next part. That was really fast. I might even be able to get this into, like, one part. I'm not sure. I'll see. Bloop.